is up guys, I'm here today speaking with um, an old friend of mine, before I introduce him, I've got a AK-47 gameplay with extended mags on Hanoi, and it's a Wii Remote gameplay, you guys wanted it, so yeah, and I'm going to let this guy, he's an old friend of mine, I've played with him since Reflex, and him gradually grew apart because he, he went over to the dark side, you know, the corporate America side, and we all know what that means. So yeah, SODZ, would you like to speak? I would love to speak. Hey guys, it's SODT here. Omega. Yeah, that was just an amazing intro I was just looking for there. Well, well thank you. Yeah, so uh, we're going to kick this off by set. I wanted to ask you, what was the contrast like from the Wii to the Xbox? Dude, big words. Chill. Contrast. <laughs> Well, it was hard at first. I was getting my butt kicked. Uh, I wasn't used to analog sticks, and I just overall sucked, but got used to it over time. Okay, that's interesting because you were, you were quite the good sniper on, on Reflex, weren't you? Yeah. You were quite looked up to, and I don't know. Honestly, seeing your gameplay now on the Xbox, it just seems a bit bad. <laughs> well, thanks. Well, I owe it all to my couch, you know, for my Wii gameplay. Because I have, like, this little armrest, and I can steady my arm, so I can hold my arm perfectly. Because you see my montage, I know scope across map, the screen's, like, perfect. That's all due to my couch, so I love this couch. Yeah. And actually, before we go any further into this commentary, I want to say sorry, I... I didn't really mean to offend you, SODT, there. I'm trying to get you more subscribers, and by saying your gameplay sucks, it <laughs> probably doesn't work. Don't listen to Omega, he's British. Yeah, I'm British. Anyways, so I'm on about carry on. Yeah. I'm on a caffeine high at the moment with tea and crumpets. <laughs> Shut up, honestly. And, so you were saying the contrast was quite easy. No, difficult even. Mm, difficult, yeah. See, I, the contrast for me, from, I like PS3 from time to time, and at first when I played PlayStation, I I just grew to it, it was just perfect for me, but enough about me, let's go on to another topic, because we love structuring our commentaries, yes indeed, so here's the next one, if you were a homeless person, and you had two dollars a day to live on, <laughs> what? what was your plan, <laughs> what would be your plan to survive, because I was thinking about this at work, and I was thinking two dollars. With one dollar, I could buy a loaf of bread each day. And with the extra dollar I had at the end, I could buy like jam, peanut, butter. Two dollars a day? Yeah. Really? Yeah, really. Well, I would go to Walmart, and I would buy water, because you can go without food for about two weeks. Average person, on every two weeks. Save up money, buy a loaf of bread, and water. Let's put it this way, we're, we're not living in the Sahara Desert here, okay? <laughs> we don't need water for a while, okay? Dude, you're homeless, how are you going to get water? I don't know, yeah. You can only live four days without water. Yeah, the thing is, I'd be hungry before I was thirsty. <laughs> That's it. And well, you should man up, because you're homeless now. Seriously. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> okay, you have all the equipment, so you have your sleeping bag, your jackets and whatnot, so all you need is your food. That's exactly literally how I see it. You could live, I could live quite easily a happy life with two dollars a day. Oh wait, no, I couldn't. What the fuck am I saying? You're crazy. Yeah. Alright, good point. This was just me trying to actually make a decent commentary and it's completely crazy. So, anyways, next topic. Yeah, let's talk about um the amazing SODT and me. Apparently, he seems to think that our commentary is very similar. He yes, I actually do. You know, in a way. Yeah, go ahead. He seems to have a very good impression of me. <laughs> no, I'm good. Oh, no. Anyways, <laughs> your commentary. I just feel that your enthusiasm is. I'm looking for, like, plain. Not that I'm much better myself, but it's just strange to me. No, but 
this is you literally like. Hey guys, it's SOTT here, and I've got a commentary for you. <laughs> so now that might be true, but you you like putting these half-hearted jokes that. These jokes which only I will laugh at. Yes, <laughs> exactly. Okay, I think I've got a dumb it down a bit for my audience. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, I, I guess we have very similar commentary styles. And what I would like to know is that you made me a, a free background and a free little picture. And I, I could have sworn that you said one day that you're making free intros and backgrounds for everyone. <laughs> I've heard of no such thing. <laughs> oh. Okay, so it's just me trying to punk you. Yeah, I think right. you are. Do you want a better <laughs> or like an emblem or where the avatar is? There we go. go on. Tell you what, I'll make you a background if you put me in your sub box and you have over a hundred subs. Okay, icon, subscribers, Omega. You, you called me icon. I love that. It, it just goes with my name. <laughs> yeah, well. I can't go anywhere without someone going, Hey, weren't you the leader of icon? And I'm like, yeah. And yes, those of you it's know, who is somewhat of a celebrity in World at War? Somewhat. What? I mean, okay, in comparison to celebrities, <laughs> I can't think of a little celebrity. Which none of you Charlie know. Sheen, what? I don't know what. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm winning. He's losing. Oh. Yeah, you're losing. You see, you see, that's what Charlie Sheen does. He just destroys commentaries. He's not the person. He's no longer my friend. No, no. You know whose fault this is? It's JD 2020's fault. Yes, it is his fault. Indeed. What did he do wrong? Everything. Everything related to Call of Duty that goes wrong is his fault. Enough said. I, I, Good talk. End of story. I honestly don't care what he does. As long as he doesn't do anything. He's just a community manager who just says, says stuff to people. When you think about it, it's not really his fault for all the hate he's getting, because he's just the community manager. He's not the one that removed quickscoping. He's just like the message boy, and people just hate on him. No, but he said he was. He said he... Oh, well, well, I was misinformed. I think he might have been a scapegoat, but... Okay, that's kind of a bit... I, I look at it as he's just the guy delivering the message, getting all the hate. Don't shoot the messenger. You kick exactly. the well. Kick the well. Get down! You! Quick scoping! Once again, JD2020 is ruined the commentary. <laughs> oh gosh. So, are there any so, YouTubers you're watching at the moment? Um, I have been watching, uh, Woody's Gamertag recently. He put out, uh, his podcast about all that giveaway crap, and that was interesting to watch. And it made me realize how much of a jerk x is. Yeah. I think if you've seen Halo, Halo A-Holes, he put in a nice, he put <laughs> a nice way. He, he spoke about these giveaways in a brilliant way. He was like... The people who are doing this aren't really helping their subscribers. It's a scam. Because really, exactly. five of them out of the hundred or so thousand that they have. What is that? Like 0.2%? That's nothing. To be honest. And I can't believe I was sad enough to work that out. <laughs> and it's actually less than that. Shut up, Max. Anyway, shit, I said my name. Oh, you yeah. <laughs> Yes, Omega, shut up. Yes, Omega. Good save, good save. Exactly. So, are there any games coming out apart from the next Call of Duty, which are all um, No, not really. See, I no. love Homefront if I don't think the Wii community knows much about Homefront. So yeah. It looks pretty good. I heard a lot of good stuff about that game. The one game I might consider looking to is uh, Battlefield 3. I mean, how good it is. I guess so. A lot of people say it'll beat, uh, whatever the new COD is. You see, I don't think it will. 
It's going to be at least another five years before someone actually comes close. Well, Battlefield is basically the next big thing. It actually is rising up. But then again, if you look at the amount of people playing Battlefield, and you look at the amount of people playing Modern Warfare 2 on PlayStation with all the hacks, PlayStation Modern Warfare 2 will still have more people. <laughs> so. So, yeah. So. So. Yes, you, you said we should do a new topic. Yes. And you had suggestions? I, I, I'm sorry, the only thing I can think of at the moment is what you put forward to uh, me, I think it was last weekend. Or, not, yeah, it was last weekend. And you said about like an actual podcast, the, the Wii, or just yeah. generally people who did play the Wii and, you know. Yeah, that would oh, yeah. be pretty cool. Yeah, sorry, I, my Skype just messed up there. Like, <laughs> it's offline. So I got kind of scared. <laughs> you scared, bro? Yeah, I'm scared. Fucking Skype scaring me again. I'm playing for Serious. This is a dual commentary with SODT and mm. HD. You see that? Exactly. So, yeah. Chicken! Why? What the fuck? Oh, yes, KFC is a good restaurant. Anyways, yes, I what was I going to talk about? Now, and I'm sure you guys are sad. Sad? Fucking hell. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure you guys have had nothing. <laughs> Which is his very uh, 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 voice. No. Oh, I just bump into HD here. It is gonna hate. Troll is gonna troll. Yes, I, I, we get that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Simply, simply put it this way, um, SODC. Yes. We're, we're saying goodbye, and I think you should go and check him out. He is actually quite a good commentator. <laughs> and Yay. Is, and he has some pretty good topics, so. Oh, 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 and uh, leave a comment if you want to see more of these dual comms, because this is pretty fun. Yeah, it was, it was kind of fun. Uh, I think our anticipation to do it is probably more fun than actually doing it, but... <laughs> <laughs> maybe we could get someone else. We, maybe this could be like a... a usual thing we could do. Maybe get someone else in. I don't know. We'll see if we can get someone else in next week. Maybe yeah, we'll do it again next week. You are right? We should do one every day. No. <laughs> I can't, speaking to you every day would be too much. No, oh, well, you see, you see people, and this is a perfect example of racism. Hey, hey, <laughs> hey, uh, I'm afraid that some of my subscribers are black, so we're, we're going to end up <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa. Now you're assuming that I'm African American and I'm pretending to be African American. No, I know you're not an African American. <laughs> Well, hold on a minute. You were suggesting that I was African American. There, you were like, "Hold, well, hold on a minute. We got some black people. They're subscribed to me." What was that about? That's about racism. <laughs> my voice is sounding nervous at the moment. And my my finger is genuinely moving towards the tone of the recording.